What's poppin' kings and queens of YouTube? My name is Tinta King, and I'm coming at you today with a brand new reaction video. You guys know what's poppin', you know what's tea, you know what's goody. I'm back today, coming at you with a new video. My good, good girl, Megan Thee Stallion. Y'all know my fucks with Megan already. Megan just dropped a new single title, Plan B. And she performed this on Coachella, everybody was going crazy. I haven't listened to it yet, because you know how I do. I like to listen and react with you. So, I waited until it was coming out, and I'm like, I'm going to react to it with my kingdom, period. And we here, all right? So, you know what's next. We're going to dive into the song first. It's not a video, so we're going to dissect the song, dissect the lyrics, and see everything that Megan Thee Stallion is giving us. Thank you for liking. Thank you for sharing. I appreciate everybody who's been subscribing lately. Continue to subscribe. I would love to have you a part of my kingdom. Now, with all of that out of the way, let's go ahead and dive into Megan Thee Stallion's new single titled, Plan B. Who the fuck you think you talking to, nigga? Fuck me, nah, nigga. Fuck you, nigga. Oh, wait. No, no, for real. Who the fuck do you think you talking to, okay? Y'all got me fucked up. Y'all got Megan fucked up. That's how I feel in my everyday life. Don't try me. We finna get into some shit. We finna get into some shit. Hey. See you. Let me get the lyrics because the lyrics not up. Yo, I'm gagging. She started off saying, Dear fuck nigga, still can't believe I used to fuck with you. Popping plan B's because I ain't playing to be stuck with you. Damn, I see you still kicking with them op bitches. I'm the only reason that you goofy ass got bitches. Yo, I'm the only reason that your goofy ass got bitches. No, for real. Mm. <laughs> no, for real though. You. Yeah, yeah, what Megan said, you really think you that, but you really not. I'm the reason why you got bitches with your goofy ass. Yo, is she talking about Mr. Lanes? Is she talking about Mr. Lanes? I feel like she's talking about Mr. Lanes. Mm, let's keep going. Them hoes wanna look like me. Yeah. It's most likely. Oh, oh. you just a spite to hey. the Oh yes, I had to block you, but you still gotta watch this shit. Still watch me, still watch the globe, still watch what you could have had and what's been done. <laughs> what's been done. Watch it, you can watch it. I don't got a problem with you watching it. You know what hair we give she ain't fucking up her makeup. Oh Damn. my gosh, okay, I just gotta say like Megan is fucking she sounds really, really, really she giving me like a look Kim. Like the Lim the Lil Kim like hard verse. Like this is different than what you know, making style and you do sound. This is not her usual type of style. It's not her usual type of flow. She usually, you know, doing her own thing, you know. It's Megan Stallion. And she fucking, she giving me this hard, like this, um, this, that 1990s type of vibe. Like, Lil' Kim era. I'm feeling this. Damn, I can't believe I used to let you fuck. Yeah. Oh. Self, cause she could get ugly. Yeah. So fuck niggas getting money. Ah, period. Get Yo, damn, I can't believe I used to let you fuck me. I'd rather be in jail before a nigga cuff me. Ladies, love yourself because this shit get ugly. That's why it's fuck niggas get money. Yo. <laughs> Megan is snapping. Megan is fucking snapping. This girl is fucking clear. They had to get this shit out of her chest. <laughs> and I got to get some shit off my chest too. So I'm going to be rapping this shit like it's mine. It's period. Because uh. nigga that dick. Don't want me. I run deep. <laughs> yeah. That you don't deserve. Yeah. It's late. It's late. It's late. It's late. I gotta stop. Oh my gosh. I am gagging. Yo, she going back to when she first met this nigga when he was trying to get her. She's like, I should have told your ass no that first time. It really be like that. Like, I shouldn't have never fucking... I, I should have never fucking did it. Listen to my first mind and told your ass no the first time. Yeah. Now he think he hurt mine. Ladies, love yourself. She could get ugly. Yeah. Last fuck niggas getting money. Yeah. We are finally finished with Megan Thee Stallion's Plan B. All right, this is a new step for Megan. This is something completely different. She's shown that she has her style of rapping that is 
fucking Megan Thee Stallion brand. She can do motherfucking the pop culture. She can do that shit. And she's showing that I can give you motherfucking old hip hop, like a 90s nasty vibe. And you motherfuckers are gonna be in tune with that. And I'm feeling with it. She gave me like Biggie. She gave me like motherfucking Tupac. She gave me motherfucking Lil' Kim. Like she really gave me that. And I'm here for it already. She was talking mad shit, getting these motherfucking niggas together. And I really feel like she was talking about Mr. Lanes. I really feel like she was talking about Mr. Lanes. Like it all adds up to Lanes. But she didn't say no names. But we can read between the lines. Like we're not dumb. Like we're not stupid. We know what's going on. We know we know what's really T. Right? Right. So we're gonna let that be that. But this is most definitely it. This is most definitely going to my playlist. This is something I'm going to be listening to. And I like talking my shit. I like talking shit about niggas. I like talking shit how about how, them, how they ain't shit. And it makes me feel empowered because a lot of them ain't. Once upon a time, not long ago, I wasn't. So I do get it. I can speak. I can speak on that because I've been there, okay? I'm a guy, all right? I know how we be. Y'all fuck boys, all right? And a lot of y'all still in the same mindset. I'm looking at you. <laughs> I'm looking at you. I ain't going to say no names. You, yeah. Change yourself. <laughs> Change yourself. Let me know what you guys thought about Plan B. This is definitely smart as fuck to release this song. Like, everybody wants to know what, how she's feeling, you know, and everything like that. This is good. And it's the fact that you premiered it at uh, Coachella and then you decided, okay, now I'm going to release it for you hoes, already. And now you can perform it at Coachella again. Straight like that, already. Let me know what you guys thought about Plan B once again. Thank you guys so much for being this part of the video. I appreciate every last one of you. You know if a video is dropping, I'm going to be taking care of it. I'm going to be watching it with you guys. So make sure you like, make sure you share, make sure you subscribe. Subscribe to be a part of my kingdom because it will be my pleasure to have you guys here. There's more videos that should be popping around the summer. Go and check those videos out. Remember to stay blessed, stay humble, and I will see every last one of you in the next video. You had to change up the game. Oh, the weather is not the same.